guys welcome back to my channel it's the girl pink sims and i'm back again today with another cc folder video now this is a 2000 subscriber gift folder now if you don't know already there is a community tab section on youtube uh, for my channel and that's where i had asked in a poll what you guys wanted me to do for my next video for a 2000 giveaway gift so if you don't already know about my community tab that means you probably don't have all your post notifications on and you need to turn that on like ASAP now let me just show you like if you come to my channel page this is what you're gonna see and you're gonna kindly go over to community and then if you want to participate in like future polls and stuff turn your notifications on to all Occasionally check on my community tab and you will see different posts that I make where I ask questions and try to find out what you guys would like to see on my channel. Anyways, now let's get into this video. Now this poses folder is a pretty big folder, y'all. These are all my poses and animations that I use in my game. Four different types of poses that you're going to find in this folder. You're going to have trade cast poses, gallery poses, Regular poses meaning couple, single, toddler, child, group poses. And then finally you're going to also have all my animations. That includes dancing animations, machinima animations, just a whole different ton of animations basically. So what I want to tell you guys is it comes in two forms. Y'all, this is very important. Listen, okay. There is a merged poses folder and there's an unmerged poses folder i'd recommend that you get the unmerged zip file as opposed to the merge file let me tell you why if you for example have some trade cast poses in your game already then the requirement for trade cast poses is that you only have one per trait so if you already there are multiple creators out there that may you have like for example one creator might create a series of model poses for active and then somebody else creates a series of model poses for active as well if you place both files into your mods folder the game may malfunction it may act whack it may try to choose one and it's just going to be a whole lot of stuff that you don't need so why i suggested that you download the unmerged packet the unmerged zip file is simply because when you download that version you can just open a zip file look through what i have in there and then decide which ones you have already which ones you don't have already now if you're relatively new to trade cast poses you can go ahead and download the merge folder because or the merge package file because that means that you would not have already had any poses in your game so it should be totally fine and let me tell you i think i have a pose assigned to almost every trait if you don't understand what i mean by trade cast pose i'm just tell you real quick uh, it simply means that when you go over here to pick a trait for your sim, it will not affect this, the trim. The, <laughs> it will not affect the trait in game. But let's say you go over here, like as you can see, I clicked on. Let me just take off all of them so you get what I'm saying, because she's posing right now. So this is Bianca McKinley. She's a sim that I made the other day. She's not quite out as yet, y'all. Isn't she cute? She's so pretty. Don't ask me what's going on with her teeth though. But anyways. If I go over here to select a trait, I have, as I said before, multiple poses assigned to traits. And all you have to do is just download the pose, the pose, put it in your mods folder, and it will automatically show up in cast. So let me just go with, okay, I'm already on social, so I do know that I have traits assigned to, not traits, I have poses assigned to loner. This is actually the male poses that I have. So these are the variety of male poses. If I click on evil, she's also going to pose a different way. And you can go ahead and click on C. And this will show up in your screenshot folder. Alright, let me just show you again. I have one assigned for active. I have for cheerful. I have for geek. I have, you get the picture, art lover, perfectionist. I have poses for almost everything. Alright, so like I said choose wisely if you put the merge in your game and you already have some poses you're doing that at your own risk as i said before recommend on merge da, 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 da. awesome all right so yeah you guys <laughs> the main purpose we're here today is for me to just tell y'all thank you so much for 2000 subscribers y'all know i work so hard and i'm so grateful that it's being recognized and also uh if you're new don't forget to like comment and subscribe in regards to the remainder of this video i did go ahead and i did post some of my sims and take a few pictures some pictures i already had in my screenshot folder on my computer so i went ahead and i collated these pictures for you oh, that's correct pronunciation for the word but whatever 
I put the pictures together and I put them in like a slideshow format for you guys to view to get a little idea of what's included in the folder. Uh, before I forget, you see, if you don't listen, you miss stuff. Before I forget, one more important thing. Uh, a lot of poses, not a lot, but some of the poses are poses that you do with accessories. Like, for example, uh, uh, what am I thinking? A book with a cup, poses with a popsicle, just generally stuff like that. And they might require you to have the accessory while doing the poses. I did also attach that pose assist the accessories for poses folder. Uh, that's also a little bit merged and unmerged for you guys as well. So you don't have to go around finding all the accessories. Now, I don't have all the accessories for all the poses because I do tend to take stuff in and out of my game. But a majority of the poses that you're going to have, you will have the accessories for once you download that file. Okay. So in regards to gallery poses, you just, whenever you go to save a sim, you click on save household. And when you have gallery poses in your game, it basically means when you click on this camera right here, when you're sharing your sim to the gallery, it's going to make her pose a particular way. Like you saw when I just opened it up a while ago. Yeah, just like that. That's all that's included in the folder. All right, so yeah. Thank you guys so much for the continued support. And do enjoy the rest of your Friday. And remember to head over to my community tab. Remember to turn your notifications on to all so that you can participate in all my future polls. And thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.